All right, guys. Here we are back in the Fallow Mire. Um, need to get a Veil Rune thing about up there. But let's see. Is there anything in this house? Doesn't look like it. Uh, well, shit then. Okay, I guess we came over here for fucking nothing. All right, guys. You can, you can disengage, because I'm running away. Oh, hey, a box. What's in the box? Become vengeance. Become vengeance. All right, we're not gonna become vengeance right now. Um, so anyway, something else I can talk about. Uh, which actually isn't on my list, but hey, let's do it because it's relevant. Hey, a book. What's in the What's the book? Uh, find Widris. Okay, well, Widris is a fucking asshole. That's what he is. So anyway, since I do have that new half-assed computer, uh, oh cool, I can't uh, can't grab a torch right now. Okay, well let's do that. Come fight me, dudes. But anyway, uh, I downloaded and installed Dragon Age Origins off of Origins, or Origin, oh gosh, I knew you'd be coming sooner or later. Uh, so get away, please, for four. Hey Cole, you know what you can do, right? You can like, not be in melee distance. I know he snuck up out of your pocket, but you don't have to keep standing right there. Um, so anyway, I downloaded Origins on Origin, and I got some fucking mods for it, that's pretty cool, I got one, uh, I got one that makes it so it, whenever I get a new party member, uh, even when starting a new game, it doesn't give them any uh, default. Of I'm conceding. I wasn't very interested to begin with. Well, then just cross your legs and guess. Conceding. I'm giving up. Some seeker you are. Wow. Yeah, Cassandra. What what kind of seeker are you supposed to be? Uh, yep, things. So anyway, I got a mod to where, like, any new character that I'm creating or any person that joins uh, uh, as a companion, uh, it does not give them any default starting abilities or uh, uh, attribute points. So, like, if I make a... Fuck, I think it's Dayla Shelf. If I make a Dayla Shelf, I don't start with poison making. I can pick what I want with that. So I effectively start with more points, uh, because I don't use poison making, so fuck you in your eyebrows. Poison making and trap making, all that shit is garbage and worthless. Well, I shouldn't say worthless. Uh, they have their uses, but they're not needed. Like, they are not fucking needed. I beat, I mean, I, I beat Origins like four times on Nightmare, maybe five and a half or something, I don't remember. Uh, certainly never was like, shit, I really need some fucking traps in this bitch. I, there was one character where I did try traps, though, but... Um, I don't have the patience for it. It's just not, it's just not even that great. So anyway, the mod, you know, whatever, I don't know why I went on that tangent. But anyway, the, you know, I can give a, so basically if I get Morrigan, right? Well, I don't even, Morrigan probably wouldn't have too many abilities from default. Anyway, let's pick, uh, Win. If you go to the Circle Tower late, then, uh, She's probably going to have a bunch of worthless shit. Actually, she always does have a bunch of worthless shit when I go get her. Um, apparently, a lot of people like to go to the Circle Tower early on, but I don't because that is annoying. Uh, unless you have Skip the Fade mod. <laughs> I downloaded that. I haven't gotten to that. I have not gotten to the Circle Tower yet, though, but uh, I will play the Circle Tower all fine and dandy. Don't care on console. I'm fine with that. But you know what? I decide on PC. You know what? I may as well. Why not? I'm. Why not skip the fade? I've I've played through it legit all the time. Okay, so that is all of that. Um. But anyway, like when you get win. Sign of the Avari um, wants to challenge me. All the Inquisition soldiers. They better be fine. And the ones who took them, they won't be. Yeah. You know that also reminds me. When I first recruited recruited Sarah, there was like a dialogue option on the left, like, that sounds like petty crime. Um, I missed out on one of her quotes because I didn't pick that. She's like, hey, we find someone not so bad, maybe they won't end up not, maybe they end up not so dead. Um, Bioware actually released that quote before the game came out, and I was wondering where the fuck in the game it was. Um, it's in that part. Um, so, yeah. <sighs> Guess that shows I shouldn't skip to the dialogue. <laughs> like, I don't, I didn't remember it on my first character, and then I just avoided it on this character. 
And then all the other characters, I probably just either clicked on it, skipped through it just to get done with the crap, and then, uh, did other things, or probably, I don't know, whatever. Uh, Sir Skywatcher. So, you're Herald of Andraste. My kin want you dead, Lowlander, but it's not my job. No fears from me. I thought the Avar wanted to fight me. Our chieftain's son wants to fight you. I'm called him when the dead pile up. Rights to the gods, mending for the bleeding, a dagger for the dying. That's what I do. Now don't pick up a blade for a whelp's trophy hunt. Why aren't you with the other of our? Trying to figure out this hole in the world. Never seen anything like it's like. They spit out angry spirits. Endless. What the sky's trying to tell us? I don't know. They're caused by the breach in the sky. It was some kind of magic gone wrong. I know that, Lowlander. I'm talking about the Lady of the Skies. Do you not know her? Can't you see the warning she writes through the bird flocks in the air? The other of our kidnapped an Inquisition patrol. Are they all right? A few were injured in the skirmish, but they were alive. Last I saw them. Someone's trained them well. They killed more of us than I thought they would. Farewell, then. Watch the water. Okay, so now I can continue talking about those DAO mods. Um, it, it is so annoying when I get a new companion, and then maybe I'm forced to have them in my party for the time being. Such as Win. Well, in console, I can uh, just give her... Uh, I can have her read a bunch of books that I duped earlier, and that can basically act as an artificial respec, more or less. Uh, that's fine and dandy, but a PC, I don't have to do that if I got mod powers. Um, so, you know, if I get a new person, they don't have to start with all the stupid garbage that I wouldn't ha have them use regardless. So, alright, you guys want to get over here so I can bury her? Oh, hey, look where Sarah is, because she's in stealth, alright. Uh, luckily, uh, barriers not all that important against these enemies, so whatever. Oh hey, let's do this, uh... Well, never mind, I got knocked over. I kind of wanted to do my spirit blade. Fuck you! And your couch! Come here! Oh gosh, how about we, uh, do that, huh? Alright. And we do that! Oh, look who just got staggered! Your fucking face! Your fucking face. Hmm. So another mod I got gave me uh, improved tactic slot things. Like now there's, okay, don't do it then. Um, now I can actually target. I, I can set a parameter, a parameter, a thingamabob. Whenever a uh, companion gets downed, although it shouldn't say dead, it should say down or unconscious or something. That'd be better. You can mend the gaps in the air. Yep. What the herald was sent here to do. Absolutely. Do have a god's favor. Sure. Aye. I. Okay then, nothing else to add to that. Alright. Uh, another mod I got was... Oh, hey, I think I do need... I'm gonna... Okay, yeah. I'm going to go down, I think. I think. What is this shit? Find... Ugh! I don't remember! Fuck it, we're going down first. Um... Hmm... Well, poops a doodles. I don't know. Fuck it. We're going down. Fuck it. Yep, we're going down. So, another mod was I, I uh, well, because on console, uh, in the previous two games, I could do this. Uh, and then I would see loot through walls and whatnot. Or at least, uh, the wording that they were there. Hey, look, a, a bag or something. Uh, and that'd be great. Um, on PC, um, I can't really do that. I have to hold tab to highlight loot, but I got a mod that will make it so, uh, I just can, I can toggle it instead, although, uh, I have noticed, um, it's not always reliable, uh, if I, I have to restart it, uh, or the, the EXE to make it work, I have to reactivate that every time I want to play the game, assuming, uh, I've turned off my computer since last time I played, which I don't know about you guys, I don't keep Ooh, my computer on. Quite a smell. Ugh, they're all slimy. They died faster than villagers could burn them. Then no one was left to burn. So anyway, I don't keep my computer on 24-7 on all times. Uh, I don't want my computer to blow up. I don't know why anyone would do that. Um, 
So, whenever I get a new session, why are you coming out of this bolt, this butthole of this shit? Uh, so whenever that would happen, restart it up, but sometimes, um, it seems like I have to, like, just toggle it on and off again, uh, whenever I get to, like, a new area, because sometimes it might highlight an item, but it won't show the name, so if I'm far away, I won't even know it's there unless I re-toggle it. Um, but whatever. Uh, at first, though, it did seem like the... Well, I'm here changing topics. Uh, at first, when I started playing, uh, it felt really weird playing with keyboard and mouse, but I think I've gotten the hang of it. Uh, I felt really awkward trying to target certain people, because I suck with a mouse and keyboard. I've never been... I, I, I can't even draw and paint with a mouse. Although, I don't know who... I don't even know who could. This shit's hard. It's fucking hard, mate. Uh, but anyway... Let's see, what are the other mods? Oh. A bear, a big scary bear. Okay, guys, go get it. Uh, so I'm trying to think of the other mods I got. Um, oh, I got one that um, allows me to like sleep at camp and make it daytime. I haven't tested it though, so I don't know if it works because I haven't gotten to camp yet on that character. Um, I think I'm in, a, yeah, I've yet to get into the Kirkari Wilds. Uh, I'm just kind of at the, uh, the Warden base or whatever. The Warden Camp. The Grey Warden Camp. Uh, not the camp of my Grey Warden. Uh, you know, the, the Grey Warden, you know, the, the whole group of them. Duncan and, uh, whatever, fuck it. Uh, all those guys at their camp right in the beginning of the game. Before the Karkari Wilds. Or Kari Wilds. Okay. <clears throat> so, I have yet to get to camp to test that out. So... Okay, a granite thing. Maybe we can find a dwarf who can make us very strong walls out of that dwarven thing. Alright. So that's actually good I did come here because this is a dead end. I was thinking it was not. Because I didn't remember where this was. But there is a ladder and a box that we can loot. All the good loots in it. Um, unfortunately, uh, climbing this ladder is more satisfactory than what is in this fucking box. So, whatever. But we gotta loot it because it's there. Can't leave that shit just laying around like a shit face. <sighs> okay. Alright, I expected that to take a lot more of my guard away. Uh... So shit, I don't remember. Did we... Did, did I... Did I... Have I... Have I played a session with this guard generating stuff yet? I feel like I've asked this question before as well. Ugh, I don't remember a goddamn thing. Alright. So, um... I will see you guys when I get there, there, and I will think about what the other mods were, because I don't remember. I, I think I, I got like six or seven mods, so I'll be able to... Okay, guys, here we are over at this area. Let's be careful not to jump into the water and alert all the bitches, and I just did it. Alright. So anyway, uh, that advanced tactics thing I was talking about earlier... Um, there actually was a thing in there, and one of the screenshots, it said there was, like, a way to make, like, uh, rogues go for backstabs, which was my main focus for getting it to begin with. However, I actually haven't been able to find that. Um, okay, guys, you can attack this one. Uh, one of the mods, oh, hey, let's preempt that. Holy shit, I, okay, well, either it worked, or that guy fucked up at casting his thing, and let's do this. <clears throat> And, uh, another one of the mods is a, it allows, uh, mages to cast spells with weapons without it putting that weapon away. So, like, if you're doing an arcane warrior, um, you know, you can, uh, <clears throat> you can attack with your sword, oh gosh, and then casting an ability, it's just gonna stay out and it's gonna be perfect and fun and shit. I gave up on trying to do an arcane warrior when I played because... <laughs> That was annoying and boring as hell. Um, <clears throat> let's see, another mod I got. Uh, there was one mod where it allowed... <laughs> it's a really minuscule thing. It allows you to hug Tamlin in the origin. And this is for narrative reasons. Um, <clears throat> like, if I record that playthrough on PC, it'll be completely for narrative reasons. Uh, that I would have this hug mod. It actually works for other people. <clears throat> in, like, certain, like, other mod-related shit, but I don't have those mods, so uh, I don't get the benefit of that. <clears throat> Another mod was 
for Cullen, if you were the, uh, <clears throat> if you were playing a mage, uh, there's, it goes more into detail about, uh, <clears throat> this is the worst nature yet. Oh, awesome. That was a very good, uh, a very good line of dialogue that pertained to nothing. Fantastic. So it goes into more detail over, like, uh, like the Cullen romance that never happened. Um, however, I don't remember. Was that in a male only? I don't remember if it was in a male only thing. But for females, if you are a female mage, I guess it goes into further detail. Uh, you can sort of start a romance with Cullen or whatever, I don't know. Uh, I haven't tried that, because I just did a Dalish start. Dalish is my favorite origin, yo. Dooters. <clears throat> uh, and I think the last mod I got... Oh, what was the last mod I got? I don't remember, actually. Hey, uh, Cole, you can get a little closer. Alright, fantastic. Oh, I wish I had a fire spell. How about I go punch you in the face? Let's see how that works. Um, oddly not as effective as I thought it would be. Um, what is the yellow damage anyway? I don't remember what yellow is. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, uh... Okay, yeah, let's go get this one. Oh, uh, that is a Revenant going for... Oh, well, I thought it was going after Cole. But, uh, how about... Uh, okay, I deserve that one. You know, maybe yellow is spirit damage. Uh, because, yeah, I was using a spirit blade. Uh, if only all the spirit-related abilities were in the spirit tree, right? Alright, so, how about you attack that guy? Cool, you can do... Oh, gee, would that really work on a fucking Revenant? Uh, I think it was immune, or Cole just didn't use it. Okay, he used it. Alright. <clears throat> okay, I hate these despair demons. Uh, when I did... I remember doing a, uh... One of my characters, I had three melee party members. Never again. Never again, because... <laughs> I remember I went to, uh... I mean, because every time I went to a Fade Rift with Despair Demons, it was the most obnoxious shit ever, because every time they get close, oh, hey, run away, and then they have to run 100 fucking feet just to go after the guy. That was pretty lame. All right, I did not get to read that thing, Mabob, but let's disable this thing. Oh, apparently it was already in the process of it. Okay, sure, why not? <clears throat> okay, so is that all I need to do over here? Oh, hey, find Widris. Good thing I know how to do that. Uh, there is a walkway. Okay, there's that walkway over there, but I think that's just the leave. I believe it is. So we're going to go in this one. Hopefully this is the one with Widris in it. Huh. <sighs> Yep, this is the one. All right, guys, let's just, uh, well, there's actually nothing I can really do about it, but we're going to be uh, alerting corpses. Fantastic. Guys, you can just walk on past. Ignore them all. Ignore them all and go after Wintress. Why does he not have other people with him? Normally he does. Okay, whatever. Oh, well, I guess there they are. Oh, boy. All right, go after that. Hey, can we, uh... I don't think I can dispel anyone. Whatever. Forget about it. Let's go get him. Uh, and we will get Widris last. Because take out these fuck... Oh. Oh, that's cute. Oh. Look what happened to your itty bitty... B and... Okay, now he's got one. Okay. Well, shit. Alright, Sarah. You can take that. Um. Oh, yeah. That's something I like. When people get knocked down, it's hard to target them. So I don't even know if I'm actually targeting them when they're knocked down. Fucking hate that shit. I think I missed with that. Or his uh, barrier got destroyed before I could even use it, I guess. I don't know. Okay. There we go. Here we go, Wittress. You're done. You're done, so. Get more pop ups on my computer. Fucking Steam. Distracting me. Ugh. Elysian stuff. Hey, activate that. Okay. Anything useful out of here to emulate power anyone? No. 
That reminds me. Uh, shit. I think there should have been an amulet of power, like, over here, maybe. Did I not explore everything? Or is it... <gasps> I didn't go up over here. I need to go do that. Well, I guess uh, I explored all this area, so I'll BRB. All right, guys. Well, here we are. I found a letter. Uh, the Lady of the Sky. Okay, that's fantastic. Is this the thing I desire? Because if so, this is not the thing I desire. Well, shit. <laughs> okay, then. I thought... I thought... I thought there would be something over here. I guess I was dunzo wronged. Um, that's fantastic. I heard there was an amulet, um, like in a house or something. Um, that's a house right there, but I don't think that's it. Um, you know what? Uh, well, I can't go that. I will kill these guys, and uh, I will be right back. Cause I really want to know where it is. If I, I don't even know if I've got it. But yeah, fair babe. Oh, hello! I found a note. Camper's message, Peter. You'll find this in the morning. I move. I've. I am moved on. I'm okay. I'm moved. That is stupid as hell. I'm moved on to the Dyer's camp, in Granite Point. Hey, I was there. Any corpses come at us, it's our job to fill them with steel before they step past the stones. Now, there's your problem using steel weapons. Probably why you fucking died if you're dead. Don't sulk like a ninny, boy. Bring a sword and defend what's left on your own damn home, Nigel Marsh. God damn, okay. So, beer beep. Alright guys, here we are over here. So, uh, I did not find any amulet uh, by scouring the area. So either I'm thinking of bad information, I, don't, I can't believe these guys don't fucking see me. Um, or I was just in the wrong fucking area. Which, uh, I hope I was just in the wrong area, because if it's not too far, I certainly would not mind exploiting a respawning amulet of power for Cassandra. I mean, the warriors have so many abilities that are really good. Um, on my previous character, um, I got coal, a whole lot of amulets, but I, like, it was really unnecessary. And I kind of only did it because it was just really easy to do. Like, gee, I walk up to him and there's a box right near his feet. Oh boy! What is this? Cleansing rune inflicts more damage based uh, against red templars and dark spawnies. Okay. Well, this certainly isn't the box. Uh, read the last city of Barandor. Do do do. All right. So, uh, oh, there's a guy right there. Let's see. Do I want? Actually, I wouldn't be surprised if it was over in that, that this area over here. I don't... Hmm, do I want to go... I feel like I should... I, I, I feel like I should go in that direction first. Doesn't look like I actually can. And shit, I hit the water. God damn it. God damn it! What have I done? I have doomed the whole world upon us now. That's for sure. I also notice... I cannot help but notice Sarah's over there. Not where I told her. But awesome. Great. Great! Great! Sarah, you are lucky. Oh, wait, that's cool. I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> uh... Well, I don't really care for coal, so you know what? Fuck you, coal. <laughs> fucking asshole. Oh, damn it, they got two bodies here. Well, shit. I guess we're gonna be fighting more assholes. Uh, for diseased tissue! Fantastic. What is that gonna do? Help me fight dead things easier? Because they're all there's so much of a threat as it is. Yeah, okay. Can't help but notice that Sarah's just sitting over there in the water too. I love it when AI is stuck in stealth and they can't go anywhere. Uh, oh, hey, nice barrier, and it disappeared before I could uh, get it. That's all right. That's all right. I don't need it. I don't need that shit, bruh. It's holding me back. Totes, ghost, put your fucking staff away. Thank you. Uh, there's nothing over there. Or is there? Nope. Don't care. Alright. Oh, hey, what the fuck? Oh, I thought, thought that was a statue. It's just a well placed uh, tr tree trunk thing. Oh, hey, dude. What's up, dude? Respect my thought, ha! Huh? Right, I guess these guys have some spirit resistance, don't they? So it doesn't seem like this spirit blade takes too much mana. You would, you would think that I would run out of mana 
by doing 10 fucking swings. But look, it's not even... Well, I am out of combat, so maybe that's why it's not costing anything. But, I mean, I'm still regenerating mana while I am, uh... Doing it, although I also have that faster mana regen while near enemies, so that's certainly going to help the cause. So yeah, you know, you'd think that I would run out if I didn't have any mana regen at all. I would run out after ten swings, but I do have mana regen, default mana regen. So maybe I would run out at like fifteen, but I also have faster mana regen now. So maybe, hey guys, you don't need to attack it. Yeah, it seems like it, it almost refills up by time, uh... By time it... it, it fuck it, whatever.